So I don't normally make videos like this, but at this point, I'm getting annoyed, and I'm getting pissed, and I just, I don't know what else to do. It's annoying me, and I just, I want answers, and I, do, I don't know how to get them. So, if you saw the title of the video, this is about the release of the score for Spongebob movie Sponge on the Run by Hans Zimmer and Steve Mazzaro. When I first saw the movie, I liked the score, and I thought, ooh, this is really good. I... I want to buy this. I can't wait for it to be released. And I remember back when they released the score for the Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water by John Debney. That took a while because it came out like two months after the film came out. So I thought, okay, well, maybe it'll just take a while for us to actually get it. And sure enough, um, Film Music Reporter, the website I usually use to check and see when the film music news, when stuff is coming out, they announced on April 2nd, that the Sponge on the Run score would be coming out on April 9th. And I was excited. I thought, yes, finally, I wanted this since I first saw the movie, and now I'm excited. So then, April 9th comes. It's 12 at 12.01 on April 9th. I go on iTunes to buy the score, and I search for Sponge on the Run, and the score isn't there, it's just the soundtrack that came out, like, back in March that has all, of, like, the songs from, like, the actual recording artists, and the score isn't there. I search Hans Zimmer, doesn't, Sponge on the Run doesn't come up. Steve Mazzaro, Sponge on the Run doesn't come up. And I thought, well, that's weird. It's kind of confusing. So I look back on the Film Music Reporter page that first told us about the score, and now there's a link that says you can download or stream it here. Click on that. Takes me to Amazon. And the score is available on there. But I thought, you know, like iTunes is how I normally do music. That's normally where I buy music. That's where I store all of the music that I get. So I didn't want to buy it on Amazon. So I just thought I'll wait. Maybe it'll come out in the morning I'll, on iTunes. I'll just wait until the morning to get it on there. Went to bed. Woke up at about 8 a.m., checked iTunes again, still not there, still not there. I go back to the Film Music Reporter page, click on that Amazon link, and now on the Amazon link it says, page not found, as if it had been taken down. And I'm like, at this point I'm getting confused, a little annoyed, because I'm like, that's really weird. Why would they, why would it not be there? Why would it have been taken down? Because it was there. And I know that other people have gotten it because there is a YouTube video posted by Positive Sounds that has the full score on YouTube. And I listened to some of it and it's the score. I know it is because I've seen the movie twice now. I can recognize the music. That is the music from the movie. There's no sound effects, so it's from the album. And the track list in the description, it's the same track list that was announced to be with the score and I briefly I saw some of the run times on Amazon before I like closed that when I first saw it and the times on there on the Amazon page before it was taken down are the same as the times on the video that was uploaded so people have gotten this score I know that so I don't know what happened I don't know what's going on then I I was confused I didn't know what else to do so I just thought you know what maybe because this had happened, like, something similar had happened before. When the soundtrack for Onward was supposed to come out, I checked at midnight. The day it was supposed to come out, wasn't there. Checked in the morning, wasn't there. But then I checked at night, and it was there on iTunes. So I thought, maybe they're waiting for it to be April 9th everywhere, in all regions. So I just sort of put it aside, went about my day. And, back, and at 8 o'clock p.m. on April 9th, I checked again, thinking, at this point, it's got to be, like, April 9th everywhere, so it has to be available now. Checked again on iTunes, still not there. Checked the original Amazon link, still says page not found. And I even found some, like, link. I found some other links. I found a link to a release of the score on Apple. Click on that link, and it says, not item not available. And then... I found another link on a site called SoundtrackTracklist.net. There are two links. One says Amazon Digital. The other says Amazon Digital Bracket UK. Clicked on the first one. 
took me to the same page not found. I assume it's just the same link as on the Film Music Reporter site page. Click on the Amazon UK link. That one takes me to the album as if it's available in the UK but not the US. Like, I can't buy it because it's the Amazon UK website, but it's there, and I'm assuming in the UK you could buy it because all of the details were there. It didn't say anything about it not being found. So I'm assuming if I was in the UK, I would have been able to buy this. At this point, I'm annoyed. I'm getting annoyed because why is it available to buy in the UK but not in the US? And why was it available briefly to buy in the US but then taken down? At this point, it's like, it's like 8 p.m. I didn't know what to do. So I just thought, okay, you know what? Maybe it's like gonna take a bit to get imported from the UK to the US. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I didn't know what to do, so I just said, okay, whatever. Put it aside. Went to bed. Woke up today, 8 a.m. Checked iTunes again. Nothing. Checked the original Amazon link. Still says page not found. But this time, this time I clicked on the Amazon UK link, and now I click on that. It says item not found. It doesn't even say page not found. It says item not available. So it has been taken down in the UK as well. Now at this point, I'm just mad because like they're trying to wipe this out from like trying to make us forget it existed, like trying to wipe it out off the internet. And I don't know what's going on. And I can't contact Paramount Music about this because Paramount Music has no social media, no Twitter, no Facebook, no Instagram, no nothing. Not even a website. The only thing I was able to find on them was a Wikipedia page and a YouTube channel. And it's like, yeah, I'm going to get in contact with them on YouTube. going to post a link. I'm going to post a little comment on one of their videos and be like, I wonder how long it takes them to respond to me. Yeah. So there's no way to contact Paramount Music as far as I can tell. I, I don't want to bother the composers with this because I'm sure they had very little to do with any of this. So I shared some of the link. I shared like the links I found, the iTunes link, the Amazon UK link on Twitter and the Film Music Reporter page. I didn't, nobody responded. So I don't know what, I don't know. I did a little bit of research in because I was wondering maybe did Sponge Out of Water when that score came out did something similar happen? So I looked back at the original announcement page for that score on Film Music Reporter. It was reported on April 9th that that was coming out. No, no, on March 9th, 2015, it was reported that that score was going to come out. And the actual release date was March 24th, 2015, two weeks later. So at this point, all I can think is maybe they accidentally sent the wrong date and it's supposed to come out not on April 9th, but on the sick April 16th. Maybe that's what happened. And maybe it got like they were meant to just like put it on Amazon and iTunes, but not actually release it. And they took it down and like leaks have happened, I don't know, like leaks have happened, like I remember back in 2020 that Eric Andre movie Bad Trip got leaked on Amazon Prime to watch for free and a bunch of people watched it, so maybe something similar happened and they just took it down. I don't know. At this point I'm just annoyed because like I can't find any, so I've looked for sources that have said it's not supposed, like the Sponge on the Run score is not supposed to come out on April 9th, it's supposed to come out on the 16th, but I can't find anything. Every source I find talking about it says it was supposed to come out on the 9th. It was supposed to come out on the 9th. But it, I don't know, it was up, it was up on the 9th on night on Amazon, but then was taken down on every link I could find. I can't find a working link to this thing and I don't know what's going on. I can't talk to Paramount Music since they have no website, no contact information, no social media, so I don't know. I can't talk to them about this. So that's why I'm making this video. I want to spread the word on this, see if any of you know what is going on, know if this is, is it supposed to come out on the 16th and they just put the wrong date on like Film Music Reporter? Is that what happened? I don't, did it get leaked somehow on Amazon? Is that, and they just took it down, is that what happened? Or maybe some of you know how to somehow get in contact with Paramount Music. If any of you can somehow give me any information on this, I would very much appreciate it because I want to give them my money. At first, I was just like, well, I'm sure it'll come out at some point. It's Hans Zimmer. I'm sure it'll come out. Now, it's like, I want to give you my money, but you're not letting me give you my money because you're taking down any method I have to give you my money. Maybe I should have just bought it when it first came out on Amazon. I don't know. 
All I know is I'm mad that this is like this is like a big headache just trying to find a way to buy this legitimately and I'm annoyed. So if any of you can somehow give me more information to like figure out how I can like what is going on or how to get in contact with Paramount Music, I'll be very appreciative. Just I know a lot of you guys who subscribe to my channel are fans of film music. Maybe some of you are interested in this and can help me. I would very much appreciate it. Have a nice day.